Right, this week I'm going to reiterate impact position um, and the work the body has to do in impact position. Um, I'm using another client of mine and a good member of this club who's given me uh, permission. John has a, a slightly different golf swing. Um, we've worked more on keeping his um, swing one plane-ish, so not lots of uh, changes of plane into the down, from the from the back swing into the down swing. Uh, keeping it simple with a very simple body turn. You'll see that John turns very nicely, just turns off the ball, tries to keep um, uh, a little bit left-sided, so not too much weight shift. Okay, and that, but what is really essential, whether it's a one-plane or two-plane swing, um, is the fact that the body or the hip turn needs to work um, down and through impact. Now, I want to see John's hips unwind quickly and his shoulders. And you'll see there's a tendency to, but not quite, that left hip is still sort of um, in the way. And as he comes into this position here, the hips absolutely stop working. And um, now the right hand takes over to try and get the club there. And you'll see on the left hand side, same thing. As he comes, he's coming into quite a nice position. And then all of a sudden, everything stops. You can see the body kind of stops. And the hands and arms sort of throw the club at the, the ball. Now, if we look at John on the left-hand side and right-hand side, he's almost looking like the way he started. Um, and he has to work quite hard on getting his hips a little bit more active. If we can just forward that on, you can see that set-up position in comparison to impact position. He has to work much harder on getting his right hip through. If I show you quickly again, just a, an example of Anthony Kim, who's a one-plane swinger, you'll see... Look at the action in the hip position, winding and opening up as quickly as possible through impact position. Okay, so John's got a really good backswing going, and you can see there that the hands just fold and tuck in away because the hips are not releasing him, and his right foot is still on the ground. So get those hips working for a better impact position and a straighter shot.